Welcome to new videos on cloud storage installation and setup. In these videos, we will install necessary files to communicate with storage of AWS, Azure and GCP file systems. We will also learn how to create permissions on Azure, AWS and GCP, create keys and other setups. With these, we will be good to work with cloud file systems in PySpark. To work with S3, WASB and GCP storage file systems, we will need to add few pre-build binaries to our Spark Hadoop directory. Let's look into how to get this working. Go to Google and type Hadoop download. You will see the search result download, Apache Hadoop, the Apache Software Foundation, from hadoop.apache.org. Click on the link and you will see the latest releases. We will not use the latest ones for this course but slightly older and more stable builds. Go to Apache Release Archive. Locate Hadoop 2.7.6. Download Hadoop 2.7.6.tar.gz. Now, unzip and untar the downloaded file. We use 7z free utility for it. Go to Hadoop 2.7.6 Share Hadoop Tools Lib Directory Copy AWS Java SDK Azure Storage Hadoop AWS and Hadoop Azure JAR files Go to your installation directory of Spark that is Spark 2.3.3 bin Hadoop 2.6 and navigate to JAR's directory. Paste the copied JAR files. Now, to install GCP libraries, go to Google and type install storage connector. You will see the search link installing the cloud storage connector, Google Cloud, from cloud.google.com. Open the link and navigate to hadoop2.x link. This will download the storage connector jar file. Paste the jar file in the same location. We are almost ready to communicate with the cloud file systems but before that we will need to set up cloud storage and set up access keys. Let's see how to create cloud storage and access keys in the next video.